I'm quite speechless at the moment because uh, no one in Australia gave us a chance. <clears throat> and, uh, you know, <clears throat> the boys, uh, what we've been through over the last, <clears throat> sorry, uh, over the last year and a half uh, with the pandemic, um, not being able to get back into Australia and players <clears throat> getting COVID and, you know, us not being able to have our <clears throat> best squad together a lot of times. Um, but, uh, you know, we, we the, the mentality of the boys uh, since they come into camp here um, was fantastic and I just uh, I couldn't be so, <clears throat> so proud and happy for the players. So we're going to be strong for the World Cup and we're going to go to the World Cup with a lot of belief and and uh, you know from today it's a clean sheet. We're back to uh, you know best players need to get on that uh, piece of paper to go to to go to uh, the World Cup here in Qatar. The uh, gratitude that I have for those players is is tenfold because <clears throat> the sacrifices they've made to play for the country and. I'll be honest, a lot of them felt that we didn't have the support back at home. <clears throat> no one thought that we could do this. But uh, they they kept believing, and that's the most important thing. And uh, I'll go and have a, and enjoy a beer with them tonight. <clears throat>